Alrighty guys, welcome back to JBSR Plays It. Uh, time to do the Cinnabar Mansion. And as I learned during my uh, Pokemon Blue speedrun, I don't actually know where the hell I'm going. So, I can't remember... I didn't catch anything from here last time. But I don't remember if it's because it killed itself or not. But I feel like it was a coughing and it killed itself. So, I'm just gonna assume I already caught something here. It's not like I have the footage, because I'm pretty sure that was when I was searching for stuff. So, I'll never know. I need to get some repels. Okay, I'll just use these repels for now. And when I run out, then I'll just have to fight wild encounters. So let's see if I can't figure out where the hell I'm going. Oh good, another escape rope. I think I've got seven of those damn things now. I'm actually gonna put Jazzle up front too. Well, Tega definitely doesn't need any work right now. All right. Off to a great start. God, you know, I just... Alright, these suck. I knew you wanted to fight me. What? Ghost? No, wrong tower, buddy. This is... This is where they experimented on Pokemon and tortured them. Why would there be ghosts here? <laughs> I mean, come on. Fucking intimidates, I swear. It's okay, Jazzle. After I beat Giovanni, I will get Earthquake. You may or may not get that. If you live, you get it. If you don't, well then, I'll be glad I held onto it. Yeah, okay, just keep intimidating me, because that's not going to get annoying at all. Trying to figure out, once I beat this, because obviously training against, well, maybe training against the wild Pokemon won't be useless. Does the Versus Seeker work on Victory Road? That is the question. Well, for now, let's brick break this son of a bitch. He'll live. Yeah, two Intimidates will do that. I need another leftovers. I don't know if I can have that many. But I can use another one. Alright, so there's nothing over here, so I guess I am supposed to go upstairs. Um Yeah, you want to fight me. Did they give you the burglar sprite? That's... Or the burglar sprite the nerd sprite? That's weird. Alright, well... Dig on the Charmander, I guess. Now I'm starting to wonder if I was overleveled getting all the way up to 39 for Sabrina. I mean, clearly I... I mean, she had level 43 Pokemon. So maybe I wasn't, but it just... That felt too easy. And then again, I should be thankful for something that's too easy. Considering Koga made me want to shoot myself. But again... Because my audio messed up, you didn't see that. But basically, it became it became a super potion fight. And just trying to hit that son of a bitch after he used 50 million minimizes. Hey, thingy. What's this? Ooh, a zinc. So useful. 
Alright. Here you go, I'm a fish. Make you bulkier. God, I have to be the only person, I think, wanting to carry a muck. And not only that, but he's become, you know, a very good member of my team. Wait, I lost it. There it is. Alright, actually... Let's go with I'm a fish, because he's actually the lowest level guy. I didn't even realize that. Um, I know I have to start hitting these switches eventually, I just don't know when I'm supposed to do it. I'm gonna guess now. Don't worry, if I start getting overly lost, I will fast forward. Yeah, okay, this is... One of these is the right way, and one is the wrong way. I don't remember which one is which. All I know is I got stuck fighting the goddamn Magnemite. Oh wait, dig. That's right. Ha! Screw your lock on. Here's a dig to the face. Ooh, magnet ton. Even more experience. And you missed the supersonic. How do you feel? Probably feel like you're about to get hit in the face. <laughs> oh man, Dig is just... It's so annoying to use, but it is hilarious when they keep trying to use... Like, depending on the moves they try and use on you after you dig. Oh, good. Voltorb. Are you gonna self-destruct? Nope. You're actually gonna use it? Ah, oh, you bastard. That's annoying. Let's gonna use Sludge then. This might actually do more damage. Yeah, okay, so Dig was useless. At least on the Voltorb. Good job, I'm a fish. Sometimes I'm tempted to rename you, but. That'll never actually happen. And now you're all better. Even though I had to watch a stupid ass animation to get there. I feel like that's that one. Yep. Oh shit, Electrode. You're definitely going to self-destruct. Ow. Please self-destruct now. Please do it while I'm underground. That was still the funniest damn thing I've ever seen in my life. Nope. Oh, well. You're dead. Uh, yeah, I'll switch out from Weezing. We're gonna go with Elsie. I know you're gonna want to self-destruct. But I will not allow it. Okay, Ted. Alright, so you're gonna give me this. Now I need. Motherfucker. Did I walk right past the statue and didn't notice it? I was supposed to hit that before I went down, wasn't I? God damn it. Alright, I'm gonna buy her some repels and then I'll just fast forward to. I don't know, whatever point feels good.
Hey guys, you know what I didn't think of? This flight of stairs that obviously goes somewhere. I just burned through all my repels, and apparently I had super repels in my bag and I didn't notice it. So, let's actually get the hell out of here. I spent most of this episode just wandering around. Seriously? That is some bullshit. You could not have seen me. You were off screen. Douchebag. Ivan. It's a very, uh, I don't know, it's a very versatile fish. Cause he's a fish, but he's poison type, but he uses ground moves. I'd say he's very versatile. MVP right here. And he's always got some food hidden in there. I wouldn't eat anything that was hidden in the muck, but you know what? He likes it. And that's really all that matters. I just don't let him cook dinner. Yay, I got off that poison that is kind of useless. Now you're gonna use rollout? Are you kidding me? And you're dead. I do find it funny that ever since the beginning of this Let's Play when I said that I was not a fan of poison types, I've been becoming a huge fan of poison types. Um, I'm doing a Pokemon Y Nuzlocke just to run through the game again real quick. Or Pokemon X, I'm sorry. And um, ended up getting a Gulpin. And if you were to ever tell me that Gulpin would become one of my favorite Pokemon on a speed or on a Nuzlocke, I would have told you you were full of shit, but the poison gas Venoshock combo, especially early in the game, is uh very useful. Okay, that's Blizzard. That used to be Solar Beam. All right, cool. Now I can get the hell out of here. What is this? Oh, there's Solar Beam. All right. So, um, all right, uh, thank you guys for watching. You're not really going to miss anything. I'm just going to leave. Um, and next time I will take on Blaine. I will definitely be fighting him for experience as well. Cause again, why wouldn't I want the experience? Oh, God damn it. I got to do that. All right. I'll go figure out how to get out of here and then I will see you guys next time.